At this time last year, Travis Wilson was a freshman sitting third on the youth's quarterback depth chart. As the season progressed, he was thrust into the starting position. Now a sophomore, Travis has shown a lot of improvement and his teammates have noticed. Kenneth Scott explained how he's improved. He's more experienced and stuff like that. He's able to recognize the coverages and so uh, it helps him release the ball quicker, have more timing and stuff like that. So it's, it gets an uh, extra advantage for him as an experience. Travis has also improved the way he throws the ball. His new motion allows him to release the ball at a high point, making it harder for the defensive line to knock the ball down and making it easier to put the ball in a spot where the receiver can make a simple catch. Receivers Kenneth Scott and Drez Anderson spoke more on the importance of the release. The way he releases, it can make you get smacked, like just blown up, or it can make you get, catch the ball and just go. So the release, uh, his release matters a lot and it, it helps the timing with the play. So it's real good that he's experienced now and knows the coverages and knows what's, when to throw the ball. I do see him like getting it up more and that's, that's good for us when it's right at our faces. Almost a guaranteed catch every time. So how has Travis Wilson improved his release? It's definitely just repping and uh, doing whatever he can to work on uh, fixing out. And that's doing a lot of stuff during the offseason, too. Wilson hasn't just improved the way he throws the ball. He's become a leader on the field. Kenneth Scott talked about his growth. I think he grew some hair on his chest, but uh, he, he's, he's, he's becoming a real good leader. You, know, you can see in his demeanor and stuff like that, which is helping because you always want your uh, quarterback to be a leader. Will Wilson's improvement show during the season? Only time will tell. I'm Austin Wolford for Newsbreak.